Hi Stampers, thanks for joining me today for another product spotlight. And this is a brand new set out of the new annual catalog called Sweet Songbirds. And the product spotlight that I'm um, featuring has the stamp set, the die, half a pack of the Butterfly Kisses DSP, which is a six by six DSP and also has five yards of the parakeet party new let's see what's it called um metallic woven ribbon all right so let's get started the video there will be four different videos um for the four different projects so let's get started with project number one all right so this project number one and it's a, a basic white card base you have a melon mambo frame which comes from the new frame set called fabulous frames all right it's this one right here as i said it's in melon mambo and i went ahead and adhered that to the front of the card base you then have a white scallop, which comes from the Stitch So Sweetly square rectangles, and it's the second to the largest. All right, and the first thing we're going to do is stamp. Let's make some room here. Um, I'm going to stamp the branch in crumb cake, and I'm going to stamp it twice. I'm going to stamp it once down at the very bottom. And then once a little bit higher up. All right. And while I've got, well, I've also done it, I did it previously, but I did also the inside and I also did the envelope. All right. The next color I'm using for the leaves is Old Olive. And there's, this is all one stamp. So the two leaves goes with the bottom branch and the three for the top. And I'm gonna go ahead and I'm stamped it once, I'm going to offset it a little bit, stamp it again, and offset it again, stamp it a third time. So it gives a little bit of um, the look like there's leaves in the background. Okay, that's all we need the green for. Then I'm going to take Melon Mambo. And I'm just gonna add a little bit of color. And I'm even gonna put one up here because I've got an oops, so it'll cover my oops, okay. It's okay that there's a flower in the middle of everywhere. It's just floating in the air. All right. Next, we've got Whoops. All right. I am missing a piece. All right. We'll do it again. So, I need a nest. And the nest is going to be out of crumb cake as well. And I stamped it on white, but then I took a blender brush and I just went over it lightly to give some dimension so it's not so white. fussy cut that and it's really a, an easy fussy cut um, just go around the outside okay. all right so what I'm going to do is decide where I want the nest and I want it, I'm gonna hang it off the edge just a little bit. 
And I'm just going to give a little pencil mark to know that I just want the bird slightly below that pencil mark. And the bird, I'm using the smaller of the two birds, and I'm using Daffodil Delight. And he's got a little white spot, a little um, open spot in his belly. So I'm going to put the pencil mark in there. Give that a good press. Hold that for a second. Okay. And then we need some eyes. And I'm going to do the eyes in Memento Tuxedo Black. All right. And the nest is then going to be popped up on dimensionals. Some of my edges are not coming off easily, but that's okay. And if you can see that pencil mark, just erase it. Okay. Then we've got the bigger bird, also st stamped in Daffodil Delight. And I stamped, this stamp here is his wing. All right. This piece fits right here on his belly. So I went ahead and stamped two of the wings and I gave, I put one behind and one in front popped up on dimensionals. So it looks like he's just flying in for a landing. And I'm gonna put him right here. Okay. And on here, I stamped it your special day. I decided on this card, I'm not gonna put anything because I don't know what I wanna use the card for. So we're going to take this scallop piece and I'm using Memento, I'm multi-purpose green glue. And I'm going to mount that onto this card base. Okay. And then this gets popped up with dimensionals. I'm using the edges. dimensional backings everywhere on my desk. If you saw it, it looks like snow. Okay, so this then, I don't want to, I don't want to do the straight on, so I'm going to give it a little bit of an angle. And there you've got card number one. All right, as I said before, don't forget your envelope. I think it's a cute, sweet card. Very happy colors. All right. I'll see you in a minute for card number two.